take a good look at this guy. Yeah. You've heard of the reindeer Rudolph, but what about a dolphin named Rudolph? So they found him beached off of Sanibel Island earlier this week. Now he is rehabbing at the Clearwater Marine Aquarium. Ted News, Candace Avila has got to see how he's doing. He ended up on December 16th getting a call about a stranded dolphin. This is a rough toothed dolphin found on the beach at Sanibel Island. Crews jumped into action to help move Rudolph from distress into their rehab pool, where they ran tests, fed him fish, and tried to get him back up to speed. We're unsure about what uh, the cause of the stranding was. This particular species is actually found out in the Gulf water, so deeper waters offshore. While Rudolph is far from home, he's making progress. He's doing well. Um, he's still compromised. I don't know again why he's stranded. We are taking quite a few tests. Uh, results could take up to 30 days, but he continues to improve. Um, we're hoping to gain weight and increase his diet. Despite the timing of his rescue right before Christmas, here's the real reason for his name, Rudolph. He is a rough tooth dolphin, which is different than what you see with our bottlenose like Winter, Hope and Nicholas. Experts say his species can get up to 8.5 feet long, 350 pounds and live up to 36 years. They also tend to travel in tight knit groups. The goal is to get him healthy enough to release. In the meantime, they're getting to know him well. Rudolph's personality, um, that's a difficult one. It just like you and I takes time to get to know a personality, uh, but I would say strong in character, if I have to say anything. Reminds me of winter, um, the dolphin that can, and I would say that's very applicable to this little animal sitting behind me. Hmm. That wonderful that we have that resource right in our backyard They're they really they do miracles there they, they do absolutely do so here's an interesting fact most other dolphins rescued and rehabbed at Clearwater Aquarium were found in the month of December too hmm.